or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you. You're better than that. <laughs> Hello everybody, my name is the Point Gamer. Welcome to another reaction video. Um, the new Death Battle that just came out today. It is Batman Beyond versus Spider-Man, the year of 2099. So I all the, the skills, weapons, what they use, how strong, fast, and what they what their what their abilities are, suits. And what they can do and everything and how they became that uh, I was about to vote for Batman Beyond but I don't know about Spider-Man 2099 I have a feeling I have to vote for him because he might win I don't know I'm more of a Batman fan than a Spider-Man fan so I'll probably go for Batman Beyond yeah, Batman Beyond. So, my vote is Batman Beyond. Yeah. And no, ordinary, um, dreamy, with, dreamy Rainbow 3D Easter Eggs, I will get on to that. Promise you, I will get on to that. But anyways, let's watch who will, let's watch who will win and die at the end. Uh, I accidentally pressed the stop the recording button instead of starring the video. <laughs> so, yeah. Sorry about that. Anyways, let's get on to the battle. There we go. Yeah, sorry, it's at 48 right now, so we're gonna watch the video in HD. Keep an eye out. I haven't seen some odd reports myself. regarding this part of the city. So we'll watch out on <laughs> HD. Hey, Bozo! I was brooding there! Who the shock are you? Who the shock are you? Fine! <laughs> Right back at you, fatty. Those hey, things are Lila, really sharp. Give me a forward. reading on this vampire guy, yeah? Of course, Miguel. I can't identify his tech or fighting style, but I can try hacking his suit. Oh, I tried to get hacking. He's too comfortable in the air. Try a different approach. Get to ground level. I can't move! Boom! Oh. Ow. You Damn. Me. That hurt. Something's trying to hack your suit. Our new friend, no doubt. How's the hack going? Nowhere fast. Get in close and finish this quick. No problem. Can my fangs I pierce his suit? I think the so. Hackers. Then I'll finish this myself. Lila! Lila! And problem solved. I guess that's one way to do it. Damn. I'll never get tired of seeing people blow up. It's always such a blast. Thanks just to his Bruce's chest, counsel, but not Terry uses the whole thing to take advantage of Miguel's devices. He pieces, devices just and his electric big shock chest. to short out large machinery to deal with Lila. Yeah, unlike Bruce, the poor girl wasn't really built for combat. And while her hacking no. skills were top notch, the isolated Batcave had the defenses to hold her off. Even still, Terry's stats edged out Miguel's in more ways than one. When it came to maneuverability and durability, they were mostly even. Both could dodge bullets and weave through the air. Both could survive heavy ballistic hits. But unlike Terry, Miguel's never outraced anything faster than a Mach 19 ballistic oh, yeah. missile. For oh, physical strength, Terry had him beat too. 
Recall that boulder that he lifted underwater. This yeah. took place in Superman's Fortress right. of Solitude near the Arctic, so the boulder was likely composed of sedimentary dark limestone, the most common rock type around that location. So we compared Terry's height to the boulder, applied the density for limestone, and subtracted the weight reduced by underwater buoyancy to find the boulder's weight to be 192 tons. Damn. And he tossed it aside like it was nothing. <laughs> Terry's peak strength in the bat suit has to be more than 200 tons. Assuming Miguel applied his fair share when holding up that antenna, his best strength feat we know of is at max 100 tons. But he's a Spider-Man! Spider-Man can lift more than that, right? Not usually. Technically, no. Miguel's powers are so different from Peter's that we shouldn't really scale him to other Spider-Men. But for the benefit of the doubt, let's do it anyway. We'll check out two of Spider-Man's most impressive strength feats. The first is the time he braced a private jet while it was landing. Look at him! He's literally the landing gear! According to Spider-Man himself, the plane's total weight was at most 115,000 pounds. Adding the thrust from a Whittle W1 engine, which this small jet is most likely to have an engine comparable to, this feat comes out to 58 tons. Damn. Not even close to Terry's 200. Then there was this one time where Spidey had to push way past his limits to lift what he offhandedly compared to as a locomotive. Since he could measure the plane, it's likely he's accurate here, but given the time period, that's still only 130 tons at most. It's clear Terry had a pretty sizable physical advantage. And just because Terry's mind wasn't as fine-tuned as the original Batman's didn't mean he's dumb. Even more, Miguel never trained like Terry did. Hell, he never really had much formal training at all. But Terry was trained by ninjas, stealth artists, and other crime fighters to be a master in the battlefield. And since Miguel didn't have a spider sense, Terry just had to wait until the untrained future Spidey left an opening. In short, while Miguel wasn't completely outmatched, Terry's superior strength counseling, equipment, and training won the bout. Turns out this Batman was beyond him. The winner is Batman Beyond. Good job, Batman Beyond. Stick around, we're about to announce the combatants for the it's next death battle. battle. And if you want to watch exclusive commentary on this episode, click that little box over there and start a first membership trial. Should try to grab one of these shirts, too. I need those shirts. Seen the season final? Well, I don't know those two. That's a problem. <laughs> uh, that was a good battle, to be honest. Don't mind the Christmas tree. If you guys don't mind the Christmas tree. Yeah, I was celebrating. You know what? You know, I have a present down here in the freaking basement. <laughs> but, Anyways, that was a good battle. I really liked it. Jesus. Can't wait for the next step battle. I don't, I don't, I don't know those two anyways, so... I don't know, but... So. That one is Beyond, Batman Beyond vs. Spider-Man 2099. This is a small death battle. That's the reaction for today. Like if you like the view. Comment. Subscribe. Thanks for watching. Brown and Gaming on. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.